<laughs> oh, I feel bad for throwing that walnut there. Oh man, okay. Gotta take care of that guy. One of those plush rooms, probably both of them are toast though. Yeah. I think what I'll do instead of replacing that puff shroom is throw a walnut there. Put another puff shroom down. That was probably a mistake. I should have thrown a second scary shroom. Oh, a screen door. No! I got this, though. Send him away. Here, what we'll do is we'll do this. Oh, screen door on screen door combat. <laughs> It's just the dumbest way to phrase things sometimes. Nom 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 nom. Oh, and mine ate him first. That's lovely. Even though we were definitely shooting at his screen for more time than that zombie was being harassed. Alright, I think we should be able to kill this screen door. Okay. Okay, when this final wave triggers, that cherry bomb is going right there, and it's gonna annihilate everything that rises from the dead. Like, not just that row, like, that that row will be completely taken care of, and then, like, everything our brains around it will be pretty solid, I think. Maybe I should put it right there instead, that would get, like, everything. Now I just gotta hope that this row up here is strong enough to weather the storm of three graves plus whatever other zombies approach. Huge wave of zombies is approaching! Exclamation point. Final wave. So it took out a lot of what I wanted to. Oh, my Hypno Shroom missed football guy. That might be bad news. That's bad news, bears. Right, I'm going to throw another Fume Shroom down here. Shroom. This guy's cool. First of all, he looks... <laughs> he looks like one of those, like, storybook frogs that are, like, peeking their head out from under the water. Okay, minus the icicle hair that it's got, but if you took that off and looked at it from, like, the eyes down, it reminds me of a frog. It temporarily immobilizes all zombies on the screen, though. Oh man. Disco zombie. All right, so I might be I might stand corrected on my stance on the scaredy shrooms. I think they actually did help me. All right, we're gonna forego the hypno shrooms since we have a, another like one-time usage thing there that can do more with the same amount of sun. I thought I forgot to choose sunflowers. To take with me since I why whatever I forgot I th or I thought I forgot to choose sunflowers because I took them on the second slot instead of the first oh. 
Whoops. Excuse me. Well, it looks like I'm going to get more than three videos out of this recording session, though. So that's nice. Upwards of an hour to get this set of levels done. Well, I don't know yet. It's like 40 minutes before I do my little edit for the minute that I was let on the noise pass over. I'm gonna throw one of those right over there. I'm probably gonna lose a puff shroom, but you know. Such is the way. Oh god. This guy. This guy becomes problematic because he spawns zombies in several rows. Because screw my bottom row that's just being manned by one puff shroom, right? Oh, I am silly sometimes, let me tell you. And I'm sitting up here with, like, complaining about how undermanned that row is, and I'm sitting up here with all of my things not cooling down because they're already ready to use, and I'm not even doing anything about it. Here. Throw a walnut on it. Throw a walnut on this guy. Uh oh. That was a mistake. Actually. That will demonstrate the power of the freeze shroom here. And this is about to be awesome. Yes! I love that. I love everything about that. Ah, I clicked off my game again. Should make a counter for that. So I think I should be good? I should be able to survive this? Yeah, we're good. Ooh, yes. Yes, yes. <clears throat> and now we have the Doom Shroom. Destroys a large, a large area, leaving a crater in its wake. So, it is like the Cherry Bomb. Except it's range, or it's... Yeah, alright. How much I like Cherry Bombs. I don't like the Doom Shroom quite as much as a actual usage, because it leaves a crater and makes the area has to recover, but I do really like the Doom Shroom too. <laughs> Let me tell you. I'll demonstrate at the nearest possible- oh man, this, uh, this row right here is gonna be in a hurt box. Talk about not knowing how many graves there will be and whether or not it'd be worth it. And then I 
And then the game just throws all of the graves at me. You don't know nothing about no predictability. sit here and think that I have to cover one more spot with a, uh, like I need to at least throw down a plant on one more spot and then turns out I already have that row covered. Throw this guy over here just because. sunflowers. There we go. Very cool. I almost clicked off my game again, but I didn't this time because I'm learning. <laughs> that was such a dumb thing to say. I didn't this time because I'm learning. Okay. <clears throat> I guess what's next to do is just uh, set up my long-range shooters here. big guy there to back up my uh, one puff shroom down there. Get a walnut there. Zombies approaching. See, they said it was going to be a huge wave of zombies, but I don't believe it's worthy of the Doom Shroom. So I'm going to wait. Because I should have enough sun by the end there to use him. put that one up there just because I don't have anywhere else in the way of protection. Uh, let's see. Throw another long range. Wow. Shoot her down there. There's not really anywhere else to put them.
All right, you know what? We'll, uh, doom. Just got rid of all of them. Your dance has been cut short. And it should be recharged at least enough. It should be ready to go again by the end of the, uh, or at some point during the massive wave. I'm gonna dig up one of these and throw down a few room instead. <clears throat> you could say that a lot of this setup is running on fumes. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Doom! It destroyed so many! Doom! I love it. <laughs> like, its effective range is way bigger than the cherry bomb, which is wonderful, but it leaves these craters. So, it does destroy your yard, unfortunately. Which, you know, as much as I like to throw down explosives, <laughs> you, I'd want to be careful. Alright, let's see here. We got another love letter from the zombies. Let's see what they have to say. Hello. We would like to visit for a midnight snack. How does ice cream and brains sound? Sincerely, the zombies. So wait, why is why is everything that they're very inconsistent with their Z's replacing the S's? For example, snack and sound both have it, but the S for sincerely just looks like a five, well, kind of, instead of a Z, and then uh, there was another. And they, I guess they don't care about S's at the end of words, either. Whatever. <laughs> oh, alright. Let's get the show on the road. Grave Buster. Oh, I'm gonna wait to use that guy. I probably should have planted him a little bit further away. Oh god. I put a, uh, yeah, I should have planted that guy further away. I forgot that I, uh, left him there. Alright, so, I've got a lot in the way of protection now. I'm getting a massive stockpile of doom shrooms that I only want I'm only saving because it doesn't feel like two zombies is worth it. Eh, whatever. Doom. Grave Buster.
Wave is approaching. All right, this is gonna be wonderful. Destroy them! <laughs> Doom. Oh, it looks like they're coming for more. Destroy them too! Yes. <laughs> One more for good measure. All right, if you say so. Oh, I guess it has like a four row range. That guy survived. Anyway, now that I've been throwing doom shrooms like a maniac, I can lay, lay down everything else that I've stockpiled while I've been waiting for that. Freeze those guys. Oh man, that zombie's gonna eat the football zombie. Won't even know what hit him. Alright, football guy's gonna eat that him, but you know, that's okay. It looks like there's a bunch of madness trying to push onto the screen, but can't even make it. <laughs> and that is kind of awesome. Oh, I missed the coin. Oh. There. Throw you there. Doom! More doom. <laughs> and my other one should be healed up. And my other, like, spots should be healed up by now. Doom! Alright, this next plant is the lily pad, which I used to never think had like a face, but it has little eyes, and I just pointed at it with my actual finger instead of the pointer. It has little eyes right there. Let's you plant non-aquatic plants on top of it, because the next set of levels is in the pool. Alright, that was fun. Thank you all for watching. I will see you next time.